Hey mom, hi sweetie. How was school? It was okay. You know, just another day in high school. Would you like a snack, honey? Well, actually, I was going to ask if Maria could come over. She really wants to come over. Can she? Well, I suppose so, but she has to be home by six because it's a school night. Thanks, Mom. All right. <laughs> this video is so funny. <laughs> hey, Mindy. Hey. How was school? <laughs> Who are you, Mom? I was just asking. Can I be nice? Sorry. I'm just a little stressed out. Why? Well, Maria's on her way over. Okay, not seeing the stress part. You're right, I shouldn't be stressed. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine, really. So Mom is actually going to let you have a friend over on a school night? She hasn't let me have a friend over on a school night. No offense, Mindy, but I'm a little more responsible than you are. And yet, I'm offended. Sorry, but I'm being honest. <sighs> Unfortunately, I know. Well, anyway, Maria wants to come over and do homework. Oh, uh, would you like me to leave so you guys can have privacy, if you don't mind? Not at all. I'm done with my homework anyway. I'll go watch TV with Mom. Thanks, Mindy. Yeah. Okay, time to call Maria. Come in. Hey. Oh, hey, Maria. Ready to hit the books? I mean, if you have any books to hit. Where's your bag? Um, I... Just got a good idea. A good idea? What does that have to do with do with why you don't have your bag with you? Because it has to do with my bag. Um, okay. I was wondering. You know, I've been so busy with cheerleading and everything. Well, yeah, I know. You and I have both been busy. I mean, I'm in cheerleading, obviously. Yeah, I know, but I'm the captain. I have a lot of responsibility. What are you trying to say, Maria? I was wondering if maybe just this once, just this once what? If you can kind of help me with my homework? Of course I'll help you. Isn't that why you're here? I mean, maybe you could write down the answers for me and do, do type my report for me and stuff. Well, how am I going to do that if I don't know what your report is? Well, actually, I kind of need you to research my report and type it. You mean do it for you? Uh, well, I wouldn't really... Maria. Okay, yeah. Just this once. I mean, you said we're best friends. I know, but it's okay. I totally trust you. I wouldn't trust anybody else to do my homework but you. Gee, thanks. Will you do it, Joss, please? I mean, you want to be my friend, don't you? Well, yeah, but then you'll do my homework for me? <sighs> Fine. Great. See ya. Wait a second, where are you going? You just got here. I have to go for my afternoon run. Gotta stay in shape if I want to stay in cheerleading. Well, I want to stay in shape, too. Yeah, I know. But it's not as important to you as it is to me. I mean, I'm the captain. I wish you would stop saying that. I know you're the captain of the cheerleaders. But that doesn't mean that you can order me around. So you're not going to do my homework for me? I I'll do it. I was just kidding when I said you were ordering me around. I thought so. Call me when you get the homework done. Oh my gosh, I've been walking on Maria's homework for like an hour. 
Maybe I'll take a break and rest my eyes for a little bit. Please, somebody help me. I'm so scared. Somebody's chasing me. Joss? Oh my god. Maria, is that you? Oh my gosh, she's still coming closer, they're coming closer. Maria! Maria, where are you? Did you call? Oh, Maria, you gotta help me. You want me to help you? With what? There's somebody coming after me. Okay, what do you want me to do? Do you think you could find me a place to hide, please? Yeah. Me do a favor for you? Please, Maria. I just need this one little favor. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm not doing anything for you. You're going to have to learn to deal with this yourself. Please, can't you do this one thing for me? Sorry. Can't. Wait! Maria! Maria! <laughs> Maria! What a disturbing dream. <sighs> this show is so funny, Mom. Yeah, they don't make them like that anymore. Mindy? Oh, hey, Joss. Are you okay? Yeah, but I need to talk to Mom in private. Do you mind? Not at all. Mom, can you pause it for me? Sure, honey. something wrong, honey? Well, I, I kind of have this problem. A problem? Yeah, with Maria. Did you guys have a fight or something? She left it off in awfully in a hurry. We didn't have a fight, Mom, but I have a feeling that we're about to have a fight. Honey, why don't you just start from the beginning? Why did Maria go home? She only came over to ask me something. What did she need to ask you? She told me how being cheerleading captain, she was too busy to study, so she kind of asked me to do her homework for her. Did you? Well, I'm still working on it. Honey, it seems to me that Maria is taking advantage of you. No, she's not. We've been friends forever. Well, at least since I went to cheerleading. Her and I have been friends forever, and, you know, we do things for each other. I mean, I give her money when she forgets her lunch money at home. I do her homework. We get along great. Don't you see a connection? What are you talking about? I think you do know. And I do have a feeling I know what you want to talk to me about. Don't you? Okay, I came to you for advice. Okay, go ahead. Well, what do you think I should do? I'm tired of doing things for Maria. I mean, I don't mind once in a while. But it's like, if I try to say no to her, when she asks me something and I don't want to do it, if I try to say no, she'll manipulate me into saying yes. And I'm afraid that if I stick to my no, then she won't want to be my friend anymore. Well, do you think Maria is a real friend if she keeps doing that to you? I don't know. I mean... She was the first friend I made when I moved here and, well, when we moved here. I know what you meant, honey. You don't have to be that specific. Well, anyway, I don't know what to do. I'm tired of doing everything for her. Did you tell Maria that? I tried to when she asked me to do her homework, but I kind of chickened out. What do you think I should do? Well, honey, I can't really tell you what to do. So I came to you for advice for nothing? Honey, I could tell you what I would do. But everybody's different. What do you think you should do? I think I should have a talk with Maria and tell her that, you know, I don't mind helping her, but why didn't she help me once in a while? I don't mean for her to do things for me either. I just mean, can't she be decent enough to, to help me out when I need it? Well, honey, don't tell me. Tell Maria. Well, I can't. It's already six. She, 
she's not allowed over. I'll make an exception just this once. Give her a call. <sighs> okay. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome. Let me know if you need anything. And then as soon as you're done talking to Maria, I want you to send her home because it's going to be dinner soon. Okay. <sighs> Unbelievable. Joss, will you stop pacing and making me so dizzy? I'm sorry. I'm just nervous. I know you are. But I know you can do this. And I'm proud of you. You are? I haven't even done anything yet. But you're going to. So I'm proud of you in advance. <laughs> you can do this, Joss. Oh my gosh, that's her. Would you like me to stay in here with you? Thanks, Mindy, but I gotta do this by myself, please. Okay, I'll go sit with Mom. Or at least help with dinner. Maybe I'll go set the table. Will you just go? Okay. Uh, come in, Maria. Hey, Joss. Hey. Did you finish my homework? Um... No, not exactly. Um, I kind of want to talk to you. Okay. What do you want to talk about? I really need to talk to you, and this is serious. I know, I'm you know, listening. What do you want to talk about? I don't know. Lately, I've been feeling like you've been taking advantage of me. That's ridiculous. No, Maria, I'm serious. You've been taking advantage of me. I don't mind helping you with things. I mean, that's what friends do. But you haven't been acting like a friend to me. You're always telling me to do things for you. And I don't mind at first, but now you're taking advantage of me. You said that already. Maria, I'm serious. Will you be serious about this? Well, I'm trying to be. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say that I can't do things for you anymore. I mean, I don't want to do your homework for you, or... I have my own problems. So what are you saying? You don't want to be friends? That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying you got to stop using me. I have to say no about things once in a while, and I shouldn't have to worry about whether or not you be my friend when I do say no. I feel like you take advantage of me. And I can't do this anymore. I didn't realize I was taking advantage of you. Look, Maria, I know you're not that smart, but you're not brain dead. You know as well as I do that you've been taking advantage of me. Okay, okay, you're right. The thing is, I don't know how to be a friend. Making friends is something I'm good at. Well, gee, I wonder why. My mom says it's my attitude. She's such an idiot. Is she? I guess not. I did take advantage of you, and I should probably apologize. Apology accepted. I said I should apologize. <sighs> okay. I am sorry. From now on, things are going to be different. Really? Really. But I do need help with my homework. I'll help you, but I'm not going to do it for you. I can live with that. And I promise from now on I'll be a better friend. That's all I ask. <sighs> Oi. Come on. Let's do our homework. <laughs>